Hey family, welcome to Nourish to Flourish. Today we are making an easy, basic, no oil contumery stew. And these are the ingredients. We have tomatoes, garlic, contumery of course, agushi, some smoked fish, basically tuna and oda. And then we have some momone for our African flavor and dawa dawa is also representing right here today we are not doing we are not doing any blending so we're just going to use our amazing salad master food processor i call it mama's helping hand really ever since i got this i've never had to invest in any cutting appliance it's five years old now and i use it almost every day so long as i'll have to cut vegetables and this cone is my favorite because it does all the basic chopping and for my medium size chopping of onions look you finish cutting before you start crying <laughs> and also i use it for cutting my tomatoes as i said today we're doing a dump and go we're chopping everything and no blending it doesn't mean we can't use a blender but today there's no blending business all we are doing is chopping everything beautiful and it's so easy to use you see when you have to fix it all you do is that you marry the hole at the base of the cone to the pin right there at the corner clockwise to fix anti-clockwise to remove this is actually the cone number four which is the slicer i use it to slice my onions and also for cutting my okra for my okra stew and i also use it for my plantain chips very fast and then we are done today i want us to focus on um, our vegetables the reason why we have to add more vegetables to our fruits and even after we get our vegetables which I know a lot of people know oh did you know that um, fruits that grow in the ground the vitamins and minerals are just under the skin so we don't have to peel them that's why we are not peeling our ginger today and also for our garlic to get the most nutrients out you should crush them and put them on the side for about 10 minutes before you cook them so it releases the allicin the main nutrients in it to fight off diseases you know our vegetables are packed with antioxidants and vitamins and minerals it's very essential for the body and for our organs and the way we prepare and cook our foods is so important that is why in our cooking systems in the salad master cooking systems we cook at very reduced temperatures we cook with little to no oils and hey with our vegetables we don't need water to cook them that's why we are adding our agushi without really having to stir the juices from the vegetables are going to cook the agushi and then we throw in our african rickles bean or dawa dawa the mamone the meat then we cover it and put it on fire when you cover it too you have to make sure your lid is sealed tight because the more you smell your vegetables cooking it's your vitamins and minerals you're smelling within your food oh yes we cook from frozen to finish as well so please when you're cooking make sure your food is covered the neighborhood doesn't have to know what you're cooking and i found some crabs in the fridge and i threw them in making it a little bit extra i think later on i added some cooked beans as well a little salt to taste in salad master you don't really need so much salt check out the temperature at which we are cooking we cook below the boiling point so that we do not kill our vegetables or the nutrients in our vegetables with high heat and then remember i said we cover completely so that we don't smell it now we hear something that will notify us when the heat is too high and then we come and check so there's no need to be caught watching oh we check and our stew is stewing <laughs> and we stirred it do you see how the agushi is popping without having to add any eggs yeah sometimes i add eggs as well there's nothing wrong with it but our stew is ready and see how beautiful it looks with no oil very reduced amount and you can see all the colors in the food color represents vitamins so if your food is still colorful after you've prepared it it means your vitamins are intact and when you taste it and it's delicious you just know that cooking your food right will make your food delicious and if it's delicious without the extra flavor enhancers then your nutrients are all intact one 